Dear friends, you are invited to witness the Christian ceremony of marriage as we bring together Noah and Anna. Let us be aware of the fact that we are in the very presence of God. You'll remember when the west wind moves upon the fields of barley. You'll forget the sun in his jealous sky as we walk in fields of gold. When you're when you're the father of the bride, I, th I don't think it uh, you let it hit yourself until you, you have to let it hit yourself. In his arms she fell as her hair came down among the fields of gold. With uh, Noah's best man and Anna's cousin, so I kind of get the the combo here, which is awesome. Um, so yeah, there, there comes a time in your life when you meet your best friend, your soulmate, and your one true love. And it's just really incredible that that was able to happen for Anna when she met me 23 years ago. <laughs> Blessing, your blessing, eternal God, in whom we live and move and have our being, bless Noah and Anna, that they may live together in marriage according to the vows they will make before you. Bless them in your love, that their love for each other may grow ever deeper, and their love for you may shine forth before the world. Bless them with your mercy, that they may be patient and caring, to the glory of the holy name of Jesus, amen. Anna. You are my best friend, and I'm so grateful for how close we've become these last two years. You're my favorite little theologian, and I, know, and I don't know what I'm going to do without you living about 15 minutes away from me. I'm going to miss our late night Frankie and Joe's runs and our gourmet home cooked meals. Noah, you're a really lucky guy. <laughs> Many years have passed since those summer days among the fields of barley. See the children run as the sun goes down among the fields of gold. I, Noah, take you, Anna, to be my wedded wife. With deepest joy, I receive you into my life, that together we may be one. I promise you my deepest love, my fullest devotion, my tenderness care. I promise that I will lead our lives into a life of faith and hope in Christ Jesus. I pledge to you my life as a loving and faithful husband. I, Anna, take you, Noah, to be my wedded husband. With deepest joy, I come into my new life with you. Noah, I will live first unto our God and then unto you, loving you, honoring you, caring for you, and ever seeking to please you. Therefore, throughout life, no matter what may be ahead of us, I pledge to you my life as a respectful, caring, godly, and faithful wife. Anna, I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine on you, be gracious unto you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give to you his never ending peace. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor to present the bride and groom, Anna Noah Brooks, husband and wife. You may kiss the bride.
we are just so excited um, for this marriage. Um, we're just driving back from the sale, and he goes, hey, can I talk to you about something? And that, that's when he um, asked for, for um, Anna's hand, and it was definitely an, an easy decision. Know and Anna, from like Carl, very early on, I knew we'd be here tonight. They are just from out of the gates. They were a spectacular couple. I love you both, and even though we're going to go our separate ways for a while, I trust that we'll hopefully be back in this area one day together. And I wish you guys the best. So, with that, let's let's do a toast to, to Anna and Noah. All the world is ours to take you and me. 